boys. Today, the plan is simple. Not just kidding. We're gonna do the UN flags from memory speedrun. Yes. What the f does that even mean? I am just going to draw every single flag in the entire world that is a member of the UN from memory as fast as possible. Oh, Bahamas is the one I thought was Barbados before. This and then a black triangle. Kinda, I don't like the yellow though. I don't like the blue either. Is it light blue? That one looks decent. I'll leave it like that. There you go, Bahamas. Grenada. Ah, man, the Caribbean kills me. Oh, Grenada? Isn't Grenada the only flag with the purple color? I think it's that one. You're wrong. I love this, this looks super nice. And just to respect the uniqueness of this flag, here we have a bird. It's supposed to be a bird, by the way. But the bird is purple. Done, that's it. It's beautiful, but it's not Granada. Uh, Guinea-Bissau. I'm pretty sure I already did that one too. Cause I did Gabon and then I did Equatorial Guinea. But I think the one I did for Equatorial Guinea is actually Guinea-Bissau and then Equatorial Guinea. What the f is the flag of Equatorial Guinea? So maybe let's just flip all the colors. So this is a flag of somewhere. Either this one or this one. One of these has to be correct. Maybe both are wrong and then I suck, but I don't give a f Cabo Verde. I get confused with Marshall Islands. So Cabo Verde is the one with the stars in the circle, I think. Okay, so it's not red for sure. Doesn't look right. Whatever, I really don't know. I'll just leave it like that. It's decent. It's probably like a five out of 10. Now we're doing Mozambique. Mozambique is a funny flag. Funny or sad. I don't know what you would call it because it has an AK-47, I think. Yeah, that looks fine. It's like what, modern communism, what the f is this? Let's do a sickle and an AK-47. <laughs> Let me try and find a better color. Cause this is a, I, I know it's not like green, green. It's like a very weird color. It's like, actually that's f perfect. There you go. Nice. Uh, what's the next one? Sao Tome and Principe. Nah, I literally don't know that one. You gotta get your shit together. Sao Tome, Sao Tome, Sao Tome, Sao Tome y Principe. Dude, I, I'm literally gonna leave it blank. I'll go back to it. Sao Tome. Next one is Papua New Guinea. It's kind of artsy. I like it. There you go. Comores. Dude, if I forgot Mauritius, how will I remember Comores? It's similar. All I need to do is add a triangle. Okay, uh, the red is the one that's making the most noise. So what about this? That looks awful. That doesn't look bad. I like that. And again, banana and star, probably. I don't know. It looks nice. I like that flag. New flag. Yeah, the banana is the key. But I, I'm not liking the red triangle anymore. Let me do one more iteration. What if I flip it entirely? Dude, this looks nice. That one looks actually even better. Suriname is Costa Rica, but green feet Vietnam. I got it. Yeah, that is a perfect description. What is wrong with you? There you go. Suriname. Done. Seychelles. I have a very cool trick for Seychelles. I'll never forget this flag. And you will never either. Start from the corner, divide it into five, and then you do Romania, and then Romania becomes Hungary. Boom. There you go. That's it. Romania into Hungary. Never forget. Accurate. Seychelles. Angola. 
Red usually at the bottom, but black also usually at the bottom. Big ass machete. That's what she said. F*** it, man. I'll just leave it like it was. There you go. It's not that terrible. Next one is Samoa. My best guess is just the the Australia Star Diamond. Mm, kind of looks decent enough. Yeah, I'll take it. Djibouti. Get your booty on the tonight. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I've seen this before. How did you memorize these many flags? I'm just a nerd, man. Vietnam is so f***ing easy. Done. Next line. Solomon Islands. Ah, I don't want to do those islands. I need to think. I need to remove the dust from my memory. Wait, Marshall Islands? I know. Because I have to do the diagonal orange-white. Vanuatu is the artistic one. Tuvalu is the one with the nine yellow stars. It's some combination of green, yellow, blue. This is ugly as f***. <laughs> I've got no idea what I'm doing, guys. That's super wrong, but it's close enough, I guess. Dominica. Wait, I think I made a huge mistake. Yep, I'm gonna correct it. Dominica is the one with the purple bird. It's not Granada. Oopsie. This one still looks kind of nice. I like that flag. Oh, this is the one that has like a shit ton of lines, doesn't it? That looks f***ing good. This one is the one with the with the bird. Is the bird in a coat of arms though? I think so. It doesn't even look like a bird, but I don't have any space for that. Bird. There we go, done. Okay, so that was like four minutes for a flag. Saint Lucia is pretty. I like that flag. No? <laughs> yes? Dude, I think I'm getting confused with St. Vincent. I'm just gonna take advantage of the fact that I just remembered and do it. Let's see if like that. So St. Lucia, it's not even a tricolor. Isn't St. Lucia then just plain blue? Yeah, there's gotta be something in the middle though. Let's go with a formula. Let's put a bird. <laughs> When in doubt, just bird and plants. That's all you need. Bird and plants. There you go. St. Lucia. Done. So close yet so far. Zimbabwe is hard because I don't remember how many colors it is. I believe it's seven or nine. So it's black in the middle and maybe three and three. Yeah, that sounds plausible. It's green, yellow, and red, I'm guessing. That looks absolutely terrible. That, I think it's that. Yeah, yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it. And what's the color of the triangle though? Nope, no, no. Is it just white? It's probably just white. Yeah, when in doubt, just put a star. Black actually. This this looks like a nice flag, I'll leave it like that. So now we skip to Belize, nice. What is in the middle? I got no f***ing idea. Let's go with the formula. Early bird gets the worm. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this one has this. Decent, Belize, done. This is a good exercise to notice how little I pay attention to the details of flags. Now we do Antigua and Barbuda. I know that one. Very beautiful flag. White sand, sea, the sky is black, I guess. Whatever, leave it like that. There you go. Done. Next, St. Kitts and Nevis. It looks so much like an African flag, but it's Caribbean. I think it's that one actually. So far, that rule has made wonders today. In general, African colors, you always go green top, red bottom. Look, how about if we all agree to disagree? But in the end, that's my favorite part, just playing with the colors until it looks right. Oh, now we do Brunei. And I'm missing something. I'm missing something really important, but I don't know what it is. I, I wanna say it's red. I don't know, man. Oh, I cannot undo anymore. Well, I'm committed then to the shield, whatever. It's a good penalty. You cannot get too creative. You can only undo 10 times and you're committed. It doesn't look terrible, but I'm pretty sure it's not correct. Namibia, Namibia. 
Namibia, 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 Namibia. What the f is the flag of Namibia? Blue, dark blue. F I, I have, I'm, I'm lost. This is Gabon again. Yeah. I'm just gonna write Namibia and go back to it. Namibia. I, I forgot the flag of Namibia, man. Liechtenstein. Isn't that just a weird Haiti? <laughs> I think this is actually quite literally the same as the flag as Haiti I did before. San Marino. This is the yellow. No, the yellow one is Vatican. And Malta I already did. Oh, Malta. Dude, I can. I, I'm gonna correct Malta. I remembered some details about the Malta flag now. It doesn't look great, but it looks better. Okay, San Marino. And I always like to do green thingies. Oh, you know what I've been missing? Most of the shields have like, uh, also that kind of stuff. There you go. Next one, Eritrea. I just said it, I said it a while ago. This is another full triangle flag, right? That doesn't look bad. That looks even better. Rings more of a bell. I think it's one of these then. I'm gonna stick to my rule. Green goes first, there you go. And this one has a weird yellow thingy over here. There you go, that's it. Eritrea, done. Monaco is just Poland, right? Smaller Poland? Wait, so then, I think Monaco is Indonesia then. I'm not sure. I, th I think Monaco is like this, actually. Okay, what are the ones I need to remember? Namibia and Sao Tome. I have an idea for Sao Tome. Let me go back to it. Because I know there's a flag that I haven't drawn yet that has more than one black star. I'm just gonna wing it, because I, I have nothing else to do. It looks like a flag to me. Is it Sao Tome and Principe? Maybe. Is it not? Maybe. Sometimes the less you think, the better. This is gonna take like four hours, man. What the f What am I doing here? Andorra. Ah, I just said it. Andorra is easy. Uh, like, don't quote me on that. You just do Romania. If you don't know how to do Romania, you do France, and then you do yellow center. And then the difference is that it has a specific shield. The best way to recognize the Andorra flag is that it has the Catalan pattern. If you like football, it's the Barcelona pattern on the top right corner. So the one that has a shield that looks like this, that's Andorra for sure. That's it, that looks decent. Palau, ooh, super easy. Palau and Lao are the only countries where the circle is not a sun, but a moon. And then you do ocean and a cheese moon. There you go, Palau, done. Kiribat. Ooh, this is one of my favorite flags, but it's so annoying to draw. It's so much detail into it. I mean, I think it looks bad just because my ocean is terrible. We're missing birds and stars and maybe a sun. Maybe all of it. It actually looks quite pretty. There you go. Okay, bad. Beautiful flag. Next one, Nauru. Uh, I'm just gonna do it out of process of elimination because I know Tonga, Vanuatu, Tuvalu. Wait a minute. I think I figured out what happened with Solomon Islands. Diagonal lines, not horizontal lines. There it is. I might've figured it out. Nah, man, this is so much worse. Dude, that looks better. I'll leave it like that. There you go. Okay, so I'm guessing then Nauru is the other one. Oh, maybe? I, yeah, I think I mixed this one with Cabo Verde. I'll leave it like that. This, this is a mix of Marshall Islands with Nauru, I think. There you go. Done. Tonga is kind of easy. It's like chilly Switzerland. Yeah. <laughs> Done. Next. Switzerland. Oh! Perfect timing, actually. Switzerland is the only perfectly square flag in the world, so let's respect that. We just do red in here. Timor Lest. Oh, this one is like Guyana, kinda. Actually, looks good. There we go. Timor Lest. Done. Next, South Sudan. Ah. I think I fucked up Sudan and South Sudan. I did the one with the with the blue triangle, so I need to do the other one. What is the other one though? Sudan, I am almost 100% sure, it recycles the same colors as Egypt and all of these countries, basically. This is, I think this is Palestine. If I cut the tip of the triangle, I think it's Kuwait. If I put a star, I think it's Jordan, but it might be Sudan, actually. Dude, I don't fucking know, I'll leave it like that. It's too much, it's too many details. Fuck it, Australia is easy. Do this first, and then we do this. Boom, there we go, beautiful. 
This is very common in Oceania. There's like a, a diamond pattern with stars. Th and you're gonna find this in Samoa. You're gonna find this in... Wait, isn't this also in Papua New Guinea? Maybe. New Zealand as well. The difference is that Australia has a big star over here and then it has another small star over here. Six in total. Ooh, I'm stupid. I just did random stars. Okay, let's do it. Let's just correct it. There you go, done. Bangladesh, super easy, super fast. This is Japan tilted towards the left side. Instead of white, you do dark green. Maybe we could use the same as, yeah, that looks nice. The same one we used for Mozambique. Brazil, Brazil is also easy. It's a bit of work. Brazil. Look at that, so professional. And I know there's one or two stars over here. There we go, done, Brazil, beautiful. Next, Canada, easy, go. Ooh, maple, that's all you need to know. Maple. Done. Canada. Next. Costa Rica is just reverse Thailand. Wait, I did Thailand, right? Yeah. yeah this too. Yep. There you go. That's it. Costa Rica. Done. Eastern Europe coming up. I think I know most of those. You, you just do a double-headed eagle every single time and you're good to go. Double-headed chicken, I should say. Federated States of Micronesia. Oh, that's the other one with the stars. There you go. Leave it like that. Next one is Fiji. I don't remember Fiji very well though. I think it's just copy paste Australia, but remove the Union Jack and put a weird ass thing. Am I just insane? I think I'm insane. I think I'm wrong actually. Nope. That looks fucking horrible. <laughs> this is not Fiji. It's so wrong. I don't know what I'm doing. Belarus. Ooh, this is a beautiful flag. Eastern Europe incoming indeed. I know I need to leave a space in here for the crochet pixel art thing. Does it, does it, does it look decent? I think it's this one, right? Let's improve this pixel art. I am demanding that the state of Belarus changes their flag. Instead of doing that pixel art, what you should do is what we cool people like to call the cool S for cool people. Better, it's better, it's improved. <laughs> cool S, there you go, nice. Next one is Czechia, easy. All you have to do is draw Poland and then the triangle in blue, and there you go, done. An A plus for Belarus tourism, yeah. I'm earning Soviet social credit, nice. 